passengers flying on board the USS Airlines. Flight number 747, departing to Padiha Kuchin. Our kindly requested to proceed now to gate number 20. Your journey is second this afternoon, and I listen. Kutuwa, Pikasos, and Jawiya, and Rahmanakon, Saba, Arba. later. Everybody, so before I mess everything up, I'm gonna show you the hotel booking. So we're here at Reed Hotel and Restaurant in Georgia, Tbilisi. Oh my god, I just took a shower. That's the first thing that I always do when like I'm in a uh, different country. The airports are stinky and stuff like that, and I have a big pimple all the time. Okay, so I'm gonna show you because it's really good. Um, so here's like the entrance. Okay, and the toilet is here. Obviously, I already used it just a while ago. But everything's there. Why is it not sent? Okay. So, yes. And then, this is the bedroom. <laughs> Don't mind my mess. I'm cleaning. So, there's like the wardrobe. The whole bed. And then, TV, which have netflix small coffee table and the best part is wait i'm having trouble opening this what in the i need to get used to this like that <laughs> oh my god anyway <laughs> anyway this is the best part there's a, a tiny little balcony here that you can see the whole area. I mean, I don't know why I can't open this. I didn't took the free SIM because it wasn't available and I have to purchase a SIM on the airport, which is like around 25 gel, Georgian Larry. And then I paid the airport taxi to here 60 Georgian Larry. I also uh, change the money in the airport, but usually a good advice is don't always 
convert your dollars or your money on the airport because outside obviously it would be more like valuable so um i took a shower i removed my makeup um i wore the same clothes uh i'm about to go outside and find the market uh to buy some snacks or to eat in a restaurant i'm not sure this is very bold of me to do so but i my mind is not working at the moment like my brain I, i'm awoke i'm awoke i'm awake since like yesterday 9 p.m and i've been awake since then so whatever i'll show you around just give me a second so after how many times and how many attempts ito na siya ta -da! hello it's so cold diba? yay okay so mag attempt tayo sorry why am i speaking in tagalog so i'm attempting to by the way shout out to my missing fake nail missing siya i am attempting to find like a place to eat because i'm really hungry although they do have like lunch but it's like 33 george and larry but it's like um set of three uh, no set of four three years so you choose a salad you choose a soup and then you choose a main course but i think that um we can find better ones outside if i do i have a feeling that it's gonna take a lot of walking so i'm gonna take you guys with me in a moment in a moment give me a moment i'm just gonna charge so by the way they gave me like two key cards this one is for the room and this one is for the elevator so i always bring it so up until here in georgia cuts the cut distribution is real otherwise where are you otherwise you're just hungry look at those eyes okay i'll feed you when i have you look you seem so fat anyway petition to find the money exchange first and then we'll eat uh, off okay so for today i went there i'll show you and all i have to do was cross from there and the funny part is there's no any crossroads that are indicating i'm not sure i think there's nothing because i've seen people just crossing anywhere and i wanted to go there because simply i wanted to change my money because i wasn't able to change my money in the airport fully and the rates are very low there and I was really really confused because I came to a country where you know like even crossing the road must be followed and civilized so here in Georgia I don't think there's no sense of crossroads like you can just walk around anywhere you want and I'm here it at the restaurant of the hotel that I'm staying because although I was able to see like shawarmas and other like um, Georgian food around the corner but I don't want to risk because I'm alone at the moment and, and it's quite busy on the road so I'm not gonna um, as you can see there's a lot of traffic as mentioned by the driver a while ago that it is really busy here in Georgia at this time especially that it's holiday it's Eid holiday and um, I ordered the lunch menu with the orange juice and I'll show you later. So I ordered um, creamy pumpkin soup, Greek salad, and orange juice, freshly squeezed. And here is my carbonara. Yay! So this is my first meal in Georgia. It's not exactly like a Georgian meal, but it's good. I'm not ready for Georgian yet because 
kind of boyfriend hasn't arrived yet, so. The last time I ate was around seven at Subway. And it's like three o'clock here already. So hello good good evening everybody it's night okay so it's night time here and um i had a ah, ah. okay so i slept already around four o'clock after i eat that lunch that late lunch i slept and i woke up nine it's nine thirty now it's so cold in here. I mean, it's not that much cold, but it's cold. And I'd like to blame my boyfriend for telling me that the coldness and the hotness of the weather here is like normal. So it's like in between. But I guess I'm, I, I didn't realize that I'm asking a person who lives in a country that the weather is like similar to this. So maybe for this, this is not cold for him, but it is cold. I didn't bring any jackets except the at least one and it's not helping um the then there's no dinner i think on the restaurant i'm not sure if there's like food served there i'm pretty sure there's like a bar so basically i am scared to go again outside because i found a crossroad but it's like far away there so to be able to reach like the specific um supermarkets and stores which is like nearby on the hotel you have to like go around the corner just to walk on the crossroad so maybe later or tomorrow we'll take chances but i don't wanna crossing the road and you know having a 50 50 percent chance of life my pimples is getting painful but you know what i do on my pimples i found out that the moment you think that you're gonna start to have a pimple you have to put ice on it so it doesn't really like bulge or form later i'll take you with me because we're going to pick him up on the airport <laughs> so we're going to pick him up on the airport i am actually planning to buy him flowers because i heard somewhere this is very sad but um given the fact of the previous um thing uh, the previous how do i say it given the fact that the previous um months uh, there's a lot of death in my family like my uncles and my grandmother um i realized that most of men do not actually receive flowers i mean i've seen this many times on tiktok on social media to explain that there are a lot of men who actually never received flowers and i wanted to um surprise him and buy him some flowers i found one on the airport for sure it's expensive i'm not sure though if it's open at 1 a.m because he's arriving 1 a.m and um there is no near flower shop nearby here not that i'm aware of um i don't know what kind of online shops available here but yeah so just checking on um just so basically it's a quick recap and i'm still alive and yeah i'll get back to you later i think i'll sleep more or stretch a bit Bye. one of the smart thing that i always do is i always make sure i have uh, medicine for cold and flu and this is my antihistamine for my allergies I was ugly a while ago <laughs> so um this is the look i don't know if you can see it um i'm trying to be like extra kind and like not too much makeup today i know i was ugly a while ago but this is what happens when you have to pick up someone at the airport um my dress or my clothes is still the same see ta -da! but i doubled my my t-shirt and my pants there's like something inside there because it's really cold i don't want to wear a jacket i curled my hair a little bit just a little bit and um yeah
I'll show you later um, what will happen to the airport. Probably we're going to have like a very late dinner. It's already 11.30. So I have to leave here around 2 o'clock in the morning. I thought his like arrival would be around 1, but it turns out it's 2. I was really groggy and sleepy and tired a while ago. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Okay, so if you're going to Georgia, always make sure that you download Bolt uh, because that is way cheaper. I just found out that it's, it takes only five minutes from airport to my hotel. And we've done it for like 20 minutes a while ago. I don't know what did the driver did, but he's like putting me round and about. And it's like cheap. 25, 30 is like the most, or 46 is the most expensive because it's a Tesla. But, like, I paid 60 gel. Sorry, it's not pounds. So, it's like maximum is like 46 for Tesla, 30 for a normal airport taxi. And I paid 60 gel for it. So, please download Bolt. You want to eat? You can eat there. No, let's go back to the Let me get. Oh, look at this. This is poor boy. Finally, I received it. They told me. Wake up. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. I know you don't eat breakfast in your country. But in mine, we do. Mm -hmm. And it's buffet. I should wake up. I'm crying. Buffet is open 8 a.m. to 11. I'm trying to wake up Prince William here. So we bought this and this and this. This one is nice. Haven't tried this yet. What is this nga? I think I know like what pa puff pastry, this puff pastry thing. What do you call it? Because we have the similar thing in the Philippines. So do we, but I don't know where it's called. This one is a tart. Ew. It tastes like princess cakes. That's how we call them. Mm. That's like Raspberry, strawberry, maybe. Do you want the salad? Hmm? Absolutely. So you're not gonna order, right? Because no, you have chicken nuggets here. No, no, no. We're gonna finish that fridge. We're gonna close the pork can. What we have. The reason why there's fridge, love, is. The reason why there's fridge is so that, like, you can, you know, stock up your food and eat it. There's a full fridge. I'll put anything in there. I can't stop crying. Oh. What is happening? It's not fair for him, so we'll try to eat. Love, are you gonna eat with me the food? I mean, not the salad, the sweet one. Because you know, if your life ain't sweeter, you eat sweet. And that's what I've been doing my whole life. Because it's upsetting. 
I'm perfect. really tempting to eat this. Wait, I show so everyone. Look at this. When I saw this on the bakery, it's so, 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 so tempting. I may, Can you may know this. Oh. But isn't it There's like. There's a huge bite in. Yeah, I know. No, I'm saying that I thought this inside is like a custard. custard, but it's not, right? It's like whipped cream. Uh, is it custard? I have no idea. I think it's whipped cream. You bite a big one. If you want, I can bite into it again and I can tell you. Maybe a, sorry. It's a subtle kind what? of it's a subtle subtle. It's a subtle. 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 I don't know, it's a it's a subtle. I don't know. Um custard. This one That one does look tasty. Wait. <coughs> I'm not a big fan of like any raspberry. Mm. Yeah. So it's just a tart and then I don't know whipped cream or like cream here and some raspberry or strawberry. It's hard to distinguish because it's not too sweet. The bakery love is not like sugary. Mm. And then this one, I forgot what it's called, but do I feel like like in the Philippines, we have this. I think it's from Turkey. I'm not sure, but it's like puff pastry. What do you call this one, Yalal? The square Which thing. One? This one, because I know there's custard also inside this, right? I call we call it princess cake. Mm. The, um. custard, the custard, right? Custard. Yeah, it's, but. It's like crispy. Crunchy but the custard here, like the sweet, is not like overly sweet. Oh so it's custard, but like subtle custard. There's like a lot of layers, and then yeah. I'm trying to make the day and the whole vacation, as we only have like a week to be with each other, and it's not fair for him. If I'm just gonna cry the whole day because of my daily drama. I think I like it. I think you're doing a little drama without oh. I wanna eat the salad now. He goes, what's cool you're saying? 